Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. It's Tragic Life here with Pokemon Yellow. We are not done. No, we have a couple more things to do. I don't know exactly what they are because I haven't quite looked ahead. But we have more things to do. So once you beat and you reboot it, you are going to pop, end up being, I guess, outside your house? You'll be outside your house in Pallet Well, hold on. My car, what are you doing, bro? Anyway, um, go ahead and hit like, the like button, uh, that subscribe button, and leave me a comment. Let's see what's going to happen. So, uh, one last place to explore that has become available now that you've defeated the Pokemon Champions. Um, I'm also going to talk during this episode. Why is there a song? Ashes House. Cool. Um, about what I'm going to be doing. I'm not, once I, I, once I, once I finish whatever I'm doing now, I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> um, I don't know why that's funny. I don't know what I'm doing. But, uh. We're going to go ahead, I'm going to go ahead and, and jump onto the Zelda game. Uh, anyway, I'm going to jump onto the Zelda and start doing the Zelda game. Um, but I'm not done with Pokemon Yellow. I still got to get all the Pokemon. So what I'm going to do is off screen, when I'm not playing Zelda or Final Fantasy V, I'm going to be playing Pokemon and getting all the, the Pokemon. I will tell you that there's not many left that I need. Um, so I've seen 140, I need 98, so that one is, I just need to level up, same with this one, it needs to level up to get these two, same here, uh, but we'll go over that at the end so you'll know which Pokemon I'm going to get, you may not see them all, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get each one that I can get, the little Pokemon sign saying that I caught it. Um, there are a couple that you cannot catch in this game. Um, you either have to trade with another one, which I don't have the ability to do, or things of that nature. So, I will be going through my Pokemon, my Pokedex, and telling you how to get each one that I do not have, uh, based on levels and where you can pick them up. Even the ones that you technically can get if you can trade. Do people still do that? I don't even have the answer. Okay, so I'm not paying attention. I'm talking so much that I'm not watching. So I want to come back here. And I want to get out... I don't know. Who do I want to put in? So we're going to deposit. I think we're going to put Butterfree away. Probably one of my weaker ones at the moment. And we're going to withdraw... Pidgey. Because I need to fly. Shut up over there. And I'm the child. I love my wife. Now you can, for those, some of the, your adult viewers are watching now, you know why. Hi there, may I help you? Do you have Master Balls? Okay, so I'm not li Oh, wait. Oh, we need to bring Pidgey up. Back. Sorry, guys. We're going to get this right. I am really looking forward to getting this out because I've always wanted to beat that game. I think I, I said it in uh, the video that I did for that. I've played that game a hundred times. I've never actually owned it, and I've never beaten it. Um, I always had friends that had it. So it's kind of cool that I'm going to get an opportunity to finally beat the game. So that's going to be cool. So now that we have that, we're going to go ahead. What? Okay, so we're going to go to Cerulean City. Um, okay, so it tells me that I want to pull out very strong Pokemon. Uh, so I need to read the thing about this. So let's see. Okay, 
so. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to. I'm actually gonna put away. Well, Snorlax is pretty good. Graveler is really good. Gloom has been good. On the star. All right, so we're gonna put away Pidgeot. We don't need to fly anymore, I don't think. Um, let's see. Moltres 50. Articuno 50. Those are probably gonna be the two that I choose from. Moltres sounds like fire, so we're gonna go and do Moltres. I might be 100% wrong, I'm just guessing. I'm seeing Moltres and it sounds like Molten. Alright. How many Ultra Moltres do we have? We have eight. That should be enough. Alright, we're gonna do, we're gonna heal one more time. I know. Like the fifth time we heal. It does smell really good. She's making chili because it's cold outside. My kind of woman. No. Alright. That's fine. Okay. So from here... Uh, I think I have an escape rope. And they, they said that I should have some... Or dig. I have dig. Um, from Cerulean City, head north to Route 24. Crossing the Nugget Bridge. Surf south and west. Is it here? Okay, so let's see. South and west. We should come. We should eventually come to a cave, so that's good. It says past the cave. Okay, there's one more trainer to fight. Alright, so we're in the right place. I came to get my mushroom Pokemon. Okay. I mean, you do you. Last wants to fight. Let's go. Okay, so she's got a Paris. A Paras. Not a very strong one, so it's probably gonna go down in one hit. I'm gonna try not to use my game. That's probably gonna kill me. Oh no, it did not. Really? You put me to sleep? Not annoying at all. Slam! Alright, Graveler got nothing, because that was terrible. Alright, Lass is about to use another one. Now I'll keep the though. I don't know if I'm going to finish this in one video. This is what looks like a pretty big area. Alright. Oh, and it's completely different depending on which version you play. That's cool. Parasite. Which is completely different items, everything. Okay. So let's see. Let me check something real quick. Oh, I hope you oh my microphone's been far away. My my bad. You want rice or just chili? Just chili works for me, baby. All right, I want to see Parasect. That's... Where is my Pokedex? All these notebooks. You guys don't understand how much notes I take. Or how many notes I take. 
What? I mean, you're gonna play, you gotta play correct. Parasect, I have one. Okay, so I don't need to catch that one, all right? Weeping Bell, I already got one. I already got a Graveler. I got a Ditto. Okay, so I don't think there's anything here that I don't have. Uh, okay, so that's cool. So we beat last. She has to say what? Oh, my cute mo mushroom Pokemon. All right, Rhyhorn. It did a, okay, so I think I got all of those. Is there anything else? Yeah, there's a lot of foresters. So this is probably gonna be a couple of videos. Alexa, set a timer for Um, I think I got a lick a tongue. I think I got a right one. I feel like I should have double checked this area, but okay. Yeah, there's a lot here, guys. Okay. So this might take me a couple of videos. Uh, Cerulean Cave is full of dangerously yet highly rewarding encounters, averaging over a thousand experience points per fight. It's a little annoying to reach, uh, having to surf out to Route 24, and it can be frustrating to deal with the array of status conditions, but it remains the best area for the grinding in the game, especially if your Pokemon are strong enough and fast enough to avoid being hit. So this is a really good place to grind. Um, and I may do that. I may do that off camera. This might be where I start grinding my Pokemon. All right. So. Okay, so gonna have to surf. I have no idea what's coming. This this already sounds like a nightmare, so... Okay, that's red and blue. I don't want to... Uh, um, give me a second. Oh. Give me a second. Uh, exploring Cerulean Cave. Alright. Watch for a one-tile wide path to the north. Alright, disembark and proceed to get a max elixir. I love how they spell it weird in this. Alright. I mean, I'm a Final Fantasy guy, so it's definitely spelled different. E L I X E R. Why? I don't know. Alright, continue west. Disembark to the dry land. Take the ladder to the second floor. Proceed northeast at the intersection to find an Ultra Ball. Turn to the previous intersection and head south. Okay, so this place is no joke. Holy, I've already lost two Pokemon. To one Ditto. Like, that thing wiped out two of my guys. Okay, so I'm going to have to be very careful here. I see. But, uh, I got a lot oh, there, yeah. Okay, so that's kind of cool. Um, I do have potions. One of the things that I hear, one of the things that I'm seeing as an issue here is money. Um, once you beat all the trainers, you don't really get any money. The only way to get money at this point in the game is to go fight the Elite Four again. Um, which is kind of crazy if you think about it. Like, there's no money-making things in this game. Um, so... I go south at the next intersection. Okay. Alright, so that was... Oh, you guys saw it. But yeah, I, I was making sure I had one of those. Ah, oh, there's... Okay. Um... The third one, north of the fourth one. Oh, that was almost worth 2,000 EX experience. By the way, this rock here has a PP up, which is always good. And we have a max revive. A little bit of... Uh, Yeah, they're not wrong. This has got a lot of... Uh, return the rock uh, and follow the path east as it loops around to the south where you will come to another... Yeah, this is going to be a great place to level up. Level 56. Yeah, great place to level up. So I'm going to go ahead and get my characters in order because we're going to level up here. Alright, we're going to put Zapdos here. Omastar is my strongest so far. Moltres, I've never used you, so we're going to also put you here. Oh, Charlie? Okay, okay, okay. I get it. Yeah. I get it. 
Alright. Okay. Back to the first floor. Surf on the water to south to follow short path to a small island? Alright, we got a rare candy. I'm gonna go ahead and give that to... Okay. I'm gonna give that to Moltres. Because, why not? Alright, um... Return to dry land. Examine the lone rock directly west from the ladder to find another hit of VP. So All right, we got another VP up. I'm sure you're gonna be my max revive. Oh, Ultra Ball. Alright. Back to the down off the plateau, continue following the path. Rush around to another ladder. Back to the second floor. Follow the path. to an intersection and go east. And the end of this route, we should get a... They really like their gold bats in here, so I'm going to go ahead and heal Mr. Uh, whatever his name is. So Max Potion. I should have bought more of these, but I don't know if I really have any. Okay, so this should be a full restore. Cool. I'm gonna probably make this a 30 minute video. Maybe 35 because of all the editing. Okay. <coughs> yeah, I'm just gonna have a lot of edit size. Not much I can do about it. I feel like I'm back in Final Fantasy IV. Are we gonna level up? Yeah, we're gonna level up. All right, Snorlax grew to level 51. So he's stronger now. All right. I'm mean, okay with it because I need to level my characters up, but man. All right. Okay, the Dittos are the most dangerous things here. All right, we finally got off this floor. Yay, where am I? All right, take steps off the plateau and proceed southeast. Find another max revive tucked in a corner. Um, head back. Well, you came past the plateau and there should be a ladder. I don't, I, think I, I don't think I've ever fought a Gloom. Um, I just realized there is something here we haven't caught, so if I come across one, and I should be coming across them soon. Ah. Cool. Wait. Should I be on a different Pokemon? I should be. I should be on the Zapdos. Oh, that'd be fun. Okay. So we're almost where we're gonna stop. I'm gonna catch a Pokemon for you. That's where we'll stop. So, okay. If the only path towards an intersection here, you take either direction, you will end up in another intersection and where you should go west of her and to the western wall. Oh, 
Oh, got a new move. That's always good. All right, we're going to go up. Was that right? All right, we're almost to where we can work. All right, so, uh, Zapdos fell to a little uh, um, sand slash or sand, whatever the strongest one of those. All right, so this is B1 uh, basement one floor. This is the only place. This is the only place in Pokemon Yellow you can catch a Lickitung. So I'm gonna go ahead and catch me a Lickitung. Be right back. All right, here we go. Let's see if I can catch him without killing him. That's gonna be the big question. Um. We know I've not had a lot of luck catching guys for you guys. Um, I might be able to do it. Since I didn't wipe him off first try, so maybe. Fingers crossed. Would you disable? Okay, well, I wasn't going to use that anyway, so. Works out for me. Okay, slam hurt. Alright, here we go. Oh, caught him on the first try, guys. That's awesome. New Pokedex data will be added. Lick a tongue. Its tongue spans almost seven feet and moves more freely than its forelegs. Its licks can cause paralysis. That is very weird. Um, so he rates this uh, in this game unranked because he has terrible stats, um, 30 base speed, and he's just not very good. Um, he's he's useless in red and blue, and you can get him earlier. And he's really useless in this because you can't. I mean, he doesn't do any well. You can trade him for something, and he says that's kind of a waste too. But we may do it. We'll see. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave it here. Um, it will continue in the next video. Um, so when I finish this cave is when we'll go ahead and talk about the Pokemon. I don't want to do it before then because we're not done. So I'll see you next video. Adios, amigos.